We've been up since 4 a.m. here ready, waiting for the rain to stop. And it finally did, so now is our moment. We are going to the island where Silkenge was first discovered. Yes, Silkenge. The mysterious structure from here that captivated the internet when it was first found. And we were the first to film the birth. And so now we know that inside this fence and tower are tiny, adorable spider eggs. But so many mysteries remain. What kind of spider? How did it make this structure? And why did it make this structure? It's back to the rainforest to find out. All right, you guys. We literally just got off the boat and I'm already seeing things that I've wanted to see here in Peru. Look at this mushroom. Now, when I say mushroom, that doesn't even do it justice. This thing is unbelievable. It's like got a net around it and it gives off a smell. It actually kind of smells like dead animal and that attracts all of these little flies. You'll see it's covered in these flies and that spreads its spores. Get in here and take a look. Wow. Okay, enough playing around with this mushroom. We've got a silk hinge to find. This right here is the setup for macaw researchers to sit, take notes, they count macaws across the way. And it was the tarp over the researchers where silk hinge was first found. Which means I have to check this tarp and see if we can find one. So silk hinge hasn't been seen for about two or three years in this area. Even though one time we went here, we found 50 in a single night. Now, we just can't find them. We have no idea why. That's why we're looking. We searched everywhere on this island where we had seen them before. On the tree trunks, on bamboo, and no luck. So we kept searching into the night. Any night in the rainforest has some surprises for you. Beautiful. It could be sleeping butterflies. Yes. Alright, sleep tight. An ogre-faced net-casting spider. A monkey frog. Or even a turtle. But alas, no silk hinge on this trip. But let's fast forward one month, when I was back in a nearby rainforest just a few oh hours away God. by Tambopata River. Oh my God! This hasn't happened in three years. What? Did you find this Holy silk? Found a silk hinge. Are oh, you kidding? Wow! Oh my god. Yep, <laughs> we found one. Actually, we found three. What you're seeing now is never before seen detail. We have a better camera, better lighting, better everything. For those unfamiliar with the silk hinge structure, underneath that middle tower and inside that white ball are several eggs, usually two to four spider eggs, which already makes it bizarre. Why? Because most spiders lay hundreds of eggs at a time, not just a few. Here's my finger to give you an idea of just how tiny they are. And then we have this fence. What is it for? Keeping things out? Trapping prey in? Mimicking a fungus on a plant? At this point, we're all guesses as silk henge is so rarely seen that we haven't been able to take the time to observe it in action in the wild. Sound off in the comments if you have any ideas. So let's take a step back. What did we learn? Well, for one thing, it seems these silk hedges are created in small clusters in the rainforest. We found three within a few meters of each other, possibly by one single female spider. This will help future searches for them. As for the details of the silk hedge itself, I gotta say, I am more impressed than ever at the overall intricacy of it. So much artistic effort to go into one tiny cluster of eggs. 
I'd like to remind you all that this is something I've been tracking down for years and it is still such a rare mystery, completely unresolved. So for those of you at home, you can sleep tight, knowing that there are still discoveries to be made, one baby spider at a time.